Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. This is Geeta. This is the same kind of problem as we discussed in the previous session. A man left his house at 7 am and travelled at an average speed of 60 km per hour. He arrived at his office 10 minutes before the time he was expected to report. Had he left at 7.25 am and travelled at an average speed of 75 km per hour, he would have arrived 5 minutes after the expected time. So how far is the office from the house and at what time is he expected to report? So he has started from his house and travelled some distance D and reached his office. So in the first scenario it is he is starting from south by 7 am and travels at a speed which is equals 60 km per hour and arrived at his office 10 minutes before the expected time. So which is minus 10 is before so it is minus 10. Minutes. Since this is in minutes, we can convert this into hour by dividing by 60, which is minus 10 by 60. Since why we are converting to 6 hour is because speed is in an hour. And in the next scenario, he has left from his house by 7.25 am and travelled at a speed of 25 km per hour. Speed here is 75 km per hour. So, in which he has arrived 5 minutes after the expected time which is plus 5. Since this is also in minutes we can convert this into hours by dividing by 60. So in this both case distance is same and they are asking for the distance. So which is this the formula we know here is speed equals distance by time. Since they are asking for distance so which is distance equals time goes here which is speed into time. And in this both cases distance is same. So we are going to equate the distance here. So in the first case which is speed 60 into time here is t minus 10 by 60. The arrival time minus 10 by 60 minus 7. So the time he has started from his house which is since he has already started it is minus 7 equals second case it is 75 times t plus 5 by 60 and this is 725 minus since this is also already happened. So which is 725 and 25 is minutes it can be converted into 25 by 60 to convert into hour. Now we have to simplify this to get the value of time. T is the time here. But before doing all this the, we can observe the question and we can know that so he has started 7 am and he is traveling at the speed of 60 km per hour. So which means in 1 hour by 8 o'clock he would have reached 60 km. So the time we are going to fi find here. So which is 60 into, so 60 is the LCM here. 60 into t is 60 t minus 10 minus 7 into 6 is 60 is 420. We are not simplifying this because we have 60 years so we can simply cancel it later. And here again it is 75 times 60 is the LCM. Here we can simplify it to make it easier which is 51 times 512 times is 60 and here it is 55 times and 51 times 6, 12 times is 60. And this can be converted into improper fraction which is 12 times 84. 84 plus 5 is 89 by 12. So here the LCM is 12. 12 into T is 12 T plus 1 minus 89. So this 60 and this 60 gets cancelled. So here it is 60 T. Minus, minus 10 minus 420 is minus 430 which is equals 75. This can also be simplified which is in 3 tables 3 2 times is 6, 3 5 times is 15 and 3 4 times is 12. So which is 25 times 12 T minus plus 1 minus 8 minus 88 divided by 4. This 4 can be multiplied to the left hand side or here it can be, we can try to simplify it here which is 60t minus 430 equals 25 and 4 is common in these two terms so we are taking out 4 
times 3t. Since we are taking 4 out, it is 3t minus 4, 22 times is 88 divided by this 4, which is 4, 4 get cancelled. Therefore, 60t minus 430 equals 25 times 3 is 75t minus 22 times 25 is 550. So, grouping t's together which is 75t minus 60t equals minus 430 plus 550. So, which is 15t equals plus 550 minus 430 is 0 to 120. So, t equals 120 by 15 which is equals 8. The actual time taken to reach the office is 8. When he started by 7 a.m. So, when he starts, home, starts from home by 7 a.m. and travels. So, what they are saying here is. So, when he starts at 7 a.m. And travels at the speed of 60 km per hour. He reaches the office at 8. Which means the time taken here is 1 hour. Whereas, he reached the office 10 minutes earlier. Before the time he was expected. So, which is. He has reached before 10 minutes. 10 minutes before 8 is 7.50. So, the distance he has travelled here is distance equals. We know the formula distance is speed into time. So, speed here is 60 km per hour into time is 7.50. Like he has travelled for 50 minutes. 50 and to convert into hour, this is divided by 60. So, 60, 60 gets cancelled which is. 50 kilometers. The distance he travelled is 50 kilometers. Thanks for watching. If you have any doubts, please let me know in the comments.